West Virginia recently implemented a law prohibiting smoking in cars with children, marking a crucial step in safeguarding minors from secondhand smoke. The legislation, albeit facing mixed reactions, aims to mitigate health risks associated with secondhand smoke exposure, particularly harmful in enclosed spaces like vehicles. Despite enforcement challenges and a modest fine of $25, the law signifies progress in a state grappling with high adult smoking rates. With health experts advocating for children's well-being and legislators debating the bill for years, the focus remains on protecting minors from the severe health implications of secondhand smoke. While some view the law as necessary for child safety, opponents argue it infringes on personal liberties and raises concerns about inconsistent regulations. Nonetheless, the ban addresses critical health issues, emphasizing the adverse effects of secondhand smoke on children's respiratory health and overall well-being.